Good morning, welcome to the forecast discussion for November 30th, 2017. It's the last day of November. Enjoy this warm weather while you can, because major changes are in the way with this weather pattern that is going to put you in the holiday spirit. Let's put it that way. If you like temperatures in the 30s, you're going to be very happy in about, a, let's say about a week from now. In terms of temperatures right now, basically we are in the mid to upper 20s over the far northern interior, upper 20s to lower 30s in your suburbs, mid to upper 30s in your urban areas and along the immediate coast. We are rather chilly this morning because we have high pressure over New England that is driving cold air south. Those temperatures are going to warm up very nicely though back into the lower to mid 50s by the time we get to this afternoon as high pressure shifts off the coast and these northerly and northeasterly winds veer to the southeast. On the radar, not much going on, pretty much high and dry out there. On the infrared satellite picture, here's our high pressure system. This high pressure system will shift off the coast, leading to southeasterly winds, and then this cold front is going to be moving through late tonight through tomorrow morning with the threat for scattered showers. These showers will be heavy at times in a few locations. For, for the most part, we're talking about a trace to a tenth of an inch of rainfall, not a major impact for the morning rush hour. Temperatures tomorrow will remain warm, but look for temperatures to be falling through the 40s tomorrow afternoon as that cold air builds in. So let's dive into this forecast. For today, sky cloud cover, look for temperatures to range from the lower to mid 50s. Tonight, clouds continue to increase, look for showers around midnight, showers continuing on through early tomorrow morning, clearing out at about the mid part of rush hour. Temperatures tomorrow morning will fall into the lower to mid 40s. And then for highs tomorrow, with high pressure taking control, look for highs in the upper 40s to lower 50s, but falling through the mid 40s later on in the afternoon. On Saturday, high pressure is in control. With scattered or broken cloud cover, we're going to have a few little mid-level disturbances keeping cloud cover around the region. Temperatures will range from the upper 20s to lower 30s for lows and mid to upper 40s for highs. On Sunday, high pressure remains in control with sky cloud cover. Look for lows in the upper 20s to lower 30s, highs in the upper 40s to lower 50s, and a repeat of that on Monday with tranquil conditions. Now on Tuesday, a cold front will approach the region. Look for increasing clouds, much warmer temperatures with a nice southwesterly wind, lows in the lower to mid 40s, highs in the mid to upper 50s. And then Wednesday, the free fall begins. Look for periods of rain on Wednesday as the cold front moves through. That rain may mix with snow and sleet at the end as this cold front exits. Temperatures ahead of the cold front in the morning will range from the upper 40s to lower 50s and then fall through the 40s and into the 30s as we move through the afternoon and evening hours. On Thursday, high pressure will be building in with sky cloud cover a bit breezy. Temperatures will range from the lower to mid 30s for lows, lower to mid 40s for highs, and then beyond that for Friday and beyond there, we'll have temperatures struggling to break 40 for a prolonged period of time. Basically, your highs in the, your highs in the 30s and your lows in the 20s and the increased potential for winter storms. Should be a pretty interesting mid to late December. That is your forecast discussion for today. I'm your meteorologist, Stephen DiMartino. Thank you for following NYNJPA weather. And as always, stay safe out there.